pillow. I know you'll keep the Edmund pillow dream alive. Seems like the mail should have arrived by now. My dear Dolores, I know how you like to use my equipment. And you may use it all you want as soon as you've taken over the pillow factory. It's Uncle Chuck's custom-built multiband oscilloscope with phase memory monitoring. He's a work of art. I'm looking forward to playing chess with him. Oh, Dolores, Dolores, Dolores. How many times have I told you not to touch my things? But as soon as you've taken over the pillow factory, they're all yours to do with as you wish. It's a defunct robot prototype. Oh, Dolores, Do oh, Dolores, but as soon as you've... It's Uncle Chuck's check register. I guess that makes it a Chuck register. I'd better not touch it. Uncle Chuck gets real angry if I'm too nosy about his business affairs. Seems like the mail should have arrived by now. Oh, excuse me. Just down the hall is the big staircase. It's the archway leading to the second floor hallway. Just down the hall is... This clock looks vaguely familiar. Maybe more highly rendered and smoother pendulum action. This clock looks vaguely familiar. The fireplace looks very clean. Seems like the mail should have arrived by now. Hi there, George. I was just about to check the mail. Great timing! You still around, Dolores? Thought you'd have left this podunk of a town by now. Yes, hopefully soon. I'm looking for a job at a game company in the big city. That's not gonna make your Uncle Chuck happy. He'll just have to deal with it. What brings you all the way out here? I have your special magazine here. Oh, I've been waiting for that. Thank you. Sure, it's what we dedicated government employees do. Walk all the way out into the country to deliver a magazine. It's our special Mailtron 3000 Mail. It's Bite Me World, the best computer magazine ever. Wow! An ad for a job at Mucus Flem Games, my favorite game company! It's the archway leading...
It's my state-of-the-art Commodore 64 with dual 1541 floppy drive. Wow, an ad. Wow, an ad for a job at Mucus Flem Game. Wow, an ad for a job at Mu. Wow, an ad for a job at Mucus. It it's my state-of-the-art Commodore 64 with. I'm dialing the Mucus Flem modem number. It's connecting. I can't believe my computer's connected to Mucus Flem. Welcome to the new online Mucus Flem job application program. Just fill out your personal information and answer a few simple Mucus programming questions. Then print out the application and send it to Mucus Flem. We'll get back to you in exactly five days. What is your name? Thank you. What is your address? Noted. Next, what's your programming language of choice? The language you are most proficient in. Interesting choice. Please answer the following questions about our proprietary mucus programming language. You must get all of the questions right to submit your application. First question. When a game ships, it is encrypted using... Thank you for taking the Mucus Phlegm programming test. Unfortunately, you did not pass. Feel free to study up and take it again. I need to go find a book about Mucus programming. These are my Chronicle of Narnia and Hitchhiker's Trilogy. I love my books. Graphics Basic, an enhanced basic. Unlock the full potential of your computer with over 100 additional English language commands. Now beginning programmers can create complex graphics, animation, and music without being a machine language programming expert. Sounds perfect. It's, it's the archway leading to the second floor hallway. Hi again, George. It's not like a government employee to make a mistake, but I forgot to deliver this important letter for your Uncle Chuck. He's busy in his workshop and can't be disturbed. I'll take it for him. Okay, Dolores, here it is. And remember, it's illegal to open someone else's mail. Punishable by a $50,000 fine and or five years in jail. Thanks, George. That's good to know. Okay, back to my vitally important government job. It's a letter to my Uncle Chuck. As expected, the post office's poorly programmed auto stamp cancellation machine has failed again. Amateurs. It's a letter to my It's a letter to my Uncle Chuck. As expected, the post office I'd bet It's a letter to my Uncle Chuck. As expected, the post- I'd better not open it. Uncle Chuck would know if I read it, if the envelope is ripped. I can't read- It's an empty bottle of homemade printer ribbon ink. I see some black powder around the edges, and it smells awful. I can't use the bottle with that. This isn't a water-based ink, not with that smell, and I wouldn't want to print something that could wash away. What a mess! Someone could cut themselves on those bottles. It's a can of non-trademark infringing Poopsie. <laughs> 